A new device has captured the attention of researchers who think it could play an important role in preventing serious illness. It is a portable pump designed to improve blood flow in the leg. CTV's medical specialist, Avis Favreau, reports. When Ferguson Keeley prepares for a walk, it's with these unusual devices. I've got mobility again. I'm not going downhill. I'm going uphill now. And it would give me, give me a boost. It generates a wave that starts from the send and progresses this way. It's called the Vena Wave, a battery-powered device strapped to the leg that massages blood upwards, according to inventor John Seringer. And squeezes the calf, constantly pushing the blood up towards the heart to improve circulation. Researchers at McMaster University are intrigued. They've done one study showing the device cuts leg swelling, another confirming it stops blood clots in the legs. It's definitely exciting to have a potential new option to treat patients with arterial disease because we don't have very many options. But some think it may have another huge potential treating leg wounds in people with diabetes. Ferguson watched his the diabetic foot sore quickly heal while using the device. Even his doctor was surprised. He said, it's a miracle. That's all I can describe it as. He said, it's healed. I wouldn't have believed it if I hadn't seen it. And other patients have reported their wounds healed quickly, so now scientists want to investigate. So if there's any new kind of device or therapy that can speed up healing, that potentially can help many, many people who have diabetic ulcers. Because it's battery operated and because it's light, uh, it's able to be worn outside and um, for the people with arterial, with post robotic syndrome, it's worn all the time. Uh, you know, when I say all the time, they can, they can wear it for as long as they like. I, I was trained as a haematologist. 35 years ago, I differentiated entirely into the field of thrombosis. I came to the master in 19, end of 1969, early 70, to establish a thrombosis program. His idea of um, this wave motion was a great one um, in, for various aspects of prevention and treatment of thrombosis. With, after discussions with him, uh, he informed me that it would be possible to develop a device which was battery operated, which allowed people to wear it after they were discharged from hospital. And this was, at that time, I think, and still is now, quite an innovation because one of the problems with preventing venous thrombosis is that the process of prevention needs to be continued well after the patient's discharged from hospital.